All right, well, Alaska, uh, the CEO of Alaska Airlines is speaking out for the first time amid an investigation into Boeing aircrafts and their faulty door plug. And many people following this. NBC's Tom Costello has more. Within hours of the midair emergency on flight 1282, Alaska Airlines CEO Ben Menicucci grounded all 65 of his MAX 9s. As an engineer, he immediately suspected the problem was bigger than just one plane. There's no doubt that Alaska received an airplane off the production line with a faulty door. And it could have cost your passengers their lives. Exactly. Minikuchi took us inside one of Alaska's grounded MAX 9s to see the door plug now being inspected on every MAX 9. A series of bolts hold it in place. The NTSB investigating whether the door plug was ever bolted in place on the assembly line. Boeing is better than this. Flight 1282 should never have happened. Should never have happened. Already, both United and Alaska have found problems while inspecting their MAX 9s. We found discrepancies uh, on many of our airplanes. Meaning loose bolts? Loose bolts. It could be a missing cotter pin. Have you conveyed your disappointment, your anger, to Boeing's top leadership about this? I'm more than frustrated and disappointed. I am angry. This happened to Alaska Airlines. It happened to our guests. It happened to our, our people. Its reputation now seriously damaged. Boeing has ordered a safety stand down for Thursday. In a statement, Boeing says, we have let down our airline customers and are deeply sorry for the significant disruption to them, their employees, and their passengers. It was five years ago that two MAX 8 crashes overseas killed 346 people. Boeing promised then it would double down on quality control. Now United CEO says he'll consider buying Airbus planes rather than Boeing's. The MAX 9 grounding is probably the straw that broke the camel's back for us. Alaska, meanwhile, is sending its own inspectors into Boeing plants to double-check Boeing's work. It was pure luck that no one was sitting next to the plug when it exploded. Looking at that video and those photos, did you think, my God, what if somebody were sitting there? There were only seven open seats, and we had a guardian angel, honestly, on that airplane. 